These are sick. I love these. Look at that. Look at that. It's like chicken. <laughs> it kind of smell like white diamonds. Can somebody invite me to their church service so I can wear this skirt? And then, yeah, so then you have like a little plant little area going around. <laughs> Where did you get the dress from, Gina? Uh, I got the dress from Target. Say it again. Target. What? What's up, guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is your girl, Sierra. Hey, yeah. And as you guys can see, I am in a new setting. Your girl is in Nola, darling. If you don't know that about me, I love freaking New Orleans. Shout out to you New Orleans. If any of you guys follow me on here, love y'all city. Uh, look, I'm like, is it a city or state? I'm so dumb. Anyway, yeah, we're staying at the Frenchman Hotel and it's a very beautiful hotel, really quaint. The room is, you know, nice size. Me and my friend, we're sharing a bed, which we've known each other since high school, so we don't mind doing that. We share beds in uh, high school. But anyway, this is my favorite area of the hotel, y'all. I would definitely say this alone is so cute. You know, just take a cute little photos in front of it. But the only thing, baby, this jacuzzi. I just really wish it got hot, hot. It did not get hot, uh, hot, hot. It's like maybe like 70 degrees, but yeah, it's a cute little vibe. Cute little vibe, do it all the time. And then, yeah, so then you have like a little plant little area going around. It's just real cute. So I'm painted there. And then you have like a little balcony. Our room is like right here. But it's so cute. So cute. I also love the little colors of it. I just love New Orleans. And sorry that it's so loud, y'all. Oh, what's over here? What's over here? Rooftop bar. Okay. But I think he said that's not open yet. Oh, and then I guess they do little events and stuff over here. That's oh, they got a little paint. Ah! I'm gonna inquire about that for sure. And then, yeah, this is the rooftop. Okay, I didn't even know this was up here, y'all. This is cute. I'm gonna read me a little book tomorrow with some little coffee. Yeah, this is really cute. So I guess this is what's, what's going to be the bar. I'm not sure if this is a new hotel or not, but the guy last night, he was telling us that the bar isn't open yet and um, that they're going to open it. But not uh, anytime soon. He was like in the future, so. But this is what it's going to look like. It's a vibe. They probably need to put some, well, what do you call it? A barellas, umbrellas up. Because it's, it's a hot one, baby. Woo! But yeah, y'all, this is what I'm wearing today. Oh, I just messed up my mascara. The same If I Fail white dress that I wore actually in New Orleans last year. It's so good for New Orleans, 100% linen. And then just a little replica because I still have yet to get my toes done. I need to go to the nail salon so I can wear my little sandals. Hopefully I get to do that today. But right now we're about to go to Cafe Dumont. Which is the place where you get the, um, I don't even know what they call it. That's crazy. Look, I'm not from here. I don't go here. Oh my God, y'all. If anybody know how I can clean this damn pleats, please bag, let me know. I think you just dry clean it though. But yeah, I was gonna wear the little ball bag, the little Mare little ball bag. But I'm like, I'm gonna bring my camera. So I think I wanna be hands free. So I'm gonna carry this dirty ass <laughs> please, please bag. But if we go out to the eat, me and Gina. Gina, you wanna say hi? Oh, you hi. look so pretty. Thank you. Yeah, if Gina and I go out for dinner, I probably will bring out this little bag. But we finna just, you know, go around the town. So I'm just gonna carry the little Izzy. The little Izzy. And um, yeah, and then these are the little shades I'm gonna wear today. I actually got these in New Orleans. I get so many compliments on these little glasses and they literally cost me, I think like $8. And I've had them like almost four years now. Gina, you know I got these glasses when you and I were here first. So like four or five years ago now. What? I've had these glasses and they're not super expensive. And I love them. Whew. Also to stay hydrated, we both got us some raw kombucha. You know, help that little immune system, that little kitty cat. It's good. So I asked my friend Gina if she had perfume. 
and she brought out this. Come on, Tom Ford. What do it smell like? Ooh. It kind of smell like white diamonds. I can go for that. I can <laughs> with powder. Yep. With powder, yeah. This, yep. But Gina said it's supposed to give a glow, which it does. And it has little shimmering effects in it. Mm -hmm. So I just want to very quickly get into my friend Gina's look because she looks damn good, sis. Let's get you over here by the water, Gina. Or no, let's get you right here. This is perfect. So this white dress, I think it's so beautiful on her. It's so clean. I love the simplicity of it. Where did you get the dress from, Gina? Uh, I got the dress from Target. Say it again. Target. What? Right. That right. blew my mind, bro. I love it. I love this like page metric piece right here. Yeah. It's amazing. Um, and also these shoes are from Zara. Period. This is and from then, Target. Yes. That's I just think that this look, ooh, this look is so neutral. It's so just chic. Thank and Gina did her own hair. Period. Don't that look like the Lemire little egg thing? Oh, this is the lobby, guys. Little accent wall with Gina. <laughs> kombucha. Not sponsored, but just love kombucha. Me and Gina was just saying how it rains in broad daylight. It's like raining. Very, very light, light, gentle rain. I love New Orleans rain, though. Even when it picks up a little bit, it's like God is kissing you. Yeah, that's what it feels like. I feel like we were in a perfect color and wait for this weather. This is what we riding in. I told Gina she is fulfilling my fantasy. Little Jeep, Jeep. And I feel like you can take the doors off. Like I, I tell y'all, this is my dream car. I kind of want to take the doors off, Gina. Yeah, we would have to. But Jeep tour. Oh, I have the key. When you live in New York, you're just not used to having things like car keys. <laughs> so this is the inside of the Jeep, guys. I love it. What's odd though is like the thing to turn up or to um, turn up and down the, what do you call it? Oh, I was just gonna say to leave my kapuja. For the window up and down is here. You know, it's used to it being like here. You, uh, gotta take the doors off, remember? Oh, right. So they make, oh, right. So if you take the door off, how can you, yeah. True. But yeah, you can see, that's how you roll down the window, y'all. Personalized Pandora station. This is the artist you want. I didn't even see the back. Yeah, this is a nice little size Jeep. I feel like I will get a Jeep. Didn't predict this one. Wow. I have to change my shoes because I'm like, I, I mean, I'm rough on things, but like, it would just be pure damage <laughs> to go out and do this. And, all right, stop it now. <laughs> Y'all, it just stopped raining out of nowhere. Look at this, out of nowhere. It didn't even like gradually we, stop. It just stopped. This is a cute little umbrella though. I love it. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it with me if I can. Probably not. Probably not. But this is the perfect umbrella. Put my little dress in, I'm like, nah, y'all. Cause it's dragging, dragging the flow. We just We've crossed the dilemma. We We're flooded in. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. I think we can hop it. Think we can hop it? All right, guys. I'm going to attempt to run over. Wait, see which part is skinnier? That part is skinnier. No, this part right here is skinnier. Okay. So this is where I got my glasses from the last time, y'all. It's like a little market over here. People selling stuff, selling jewelry, hats, backpacks. Everything. 
So y'all, this is the line for the place, y'all. Cafe Duan. This the line. So we stood in the line, guys. And now we have our Cafe Duan. And what is this called, Gina? Cafe what? So we are beignet up, and it has stopped raining. Now it's sunny outside. Love it. We in this little shop, y'all. I want this one. Cause it's cancer, cancer season. It's over, but cancer season. What happened? Gerald is a, a real man, but they don't have it. Wait, are these knives? Stop into another antique store. Another little pearl. It must be like something like closer to New Orleans. Yeah. Oh, these cameras. What's scary, Gina? What? What's such a thing? All the time, it's a camera. It is. <laughs> Probably. Is this a grinder? What is that? That's so cool. So we are pulling up to the Goodwill, you guys, and look at how humongous this is. So this is the thrift store. This, this shirt will be pretty for somebody, not me, because I'm too broad, but it's 100% cotton. I think it's very pretty. Oh, that's so cute. I was hoping you put it down. <laughs> oh, shit, y'all. <laughs> Can somebody invite me to their church service so I can wear this skirt? So Gina and I are trying on right outside the fitting room, y'all, because they occupy. Huh? I was waiting for that. Right. I was waiting for that. I had picked this skirt out for Gina. I love it. You I mean that's easy to find. I was gonna do this sweater, y'all, but it smells terrible. <laughs> but I do love it. I feel like I could dry clean. So we just left the thrift store, y'all, and we are at our favorite restaurant here in New Orleans. So Gina and I, Gina is the first person I came to New Orleans with, and we discovered this place together. And I've, this is now my third time here. All right, y'all, so this is what our food looking like. They come in little bitty baggies. It's already seasoned. These are the potatoes. Got some corn. I got me a turkey neck. I'm so happy for this turkey neck. Oh my God, I haven't had that turkey neck since literally I lived in Chicago. My grandma used to make them with hot sauce. And some funky shrimp. Put the head on, which is what I love. Yeah, y'all, we finna dig in. All right, y'all, so we are getting dressed right now and Gina is trying to see if she should wear the green shoe. Gina, can you stand up? Actually, let's close the window. Let's close this door and you can see in front. Perfect. So this is what she looks like with the green shoe. I think that this is a vibe. I feel like this is so cute for New Orleans too. And like this, yes, the spirit of New Orleans, the colors of New Orleans, perfect. But she showed me these little white ones and I'm like, holla, holla, holla. Cause this is giving a cute little minimal little vibe that I'm really, really feeling. So let's see Gina. So this is what Gina looks like with the white. Ugh. I think ultimately I'm leaning towards the white. Yeah? Yeah. And like the minimal. Gonna, it's the thongness. Yes. The thongness. It's given like boss bitch. All right, y'all. So I have a dilemma. Gina is helping me out though. Um, I don't know what to wear. I think that I want to wear this, but then I'm like, I kind of want to save this look for something else. I don't know if you guys have ever felt that way. Comment down below if you've ever felt that way. But I just thrifted this shirt today, y'all. Me and Gina went to the Goodwill. Um, 
around here and seen this shirt on the rail and as you guys can see it's very very long so that's mm -hmm. why i have it tied up but it's a total freaking vibe i feel like i'm gonna wear it like on its own too but for the sake of this skirt because i want to show the detail of the skirt i chose to like put a little knot in it but i'm like do i really want to wear this today but also the other option is going to be wow just this stunner. which also kind of matches gina vibe too like it's really thin and girly and i feel like i should do this in new orleans right like i feel like i should give this i love the the hip come on and also it's come on middle. pelvic girdle okay Look at this little froggy, guys. Look at him. He's so cute. Oh. Go ahead, little fella. Go ahead. Shh. We're just walking around right now. And as you can see, this is the point in the vlog where I get a little bit awkward. I love my shirt, though. I'm so happy I found this shirt today. <laughs> so happy that I had to wear it today. I don't know what we just walked into, but this is cute. Wow. Ooh, that's cute. <laughs> this is the cancer one. The Capricorn one. The Leo, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius at the top, Gemini, Taurus, Aries, Pisces, I'm not Capricorn. No, 14 karat gold fill is gonna be no nickel, and it doesn't tarnish at all. Look at this for all you anime lovers. Jizz out right now. Check out David, guys. <laughs> this is so cool. And the eyes are in a trance. Yeah, that represents the trance of pop culture. I don't do it. I love these, though. I don't even watch anime. Dang. Hey guys, let me clean you off. Sorry I had put my camera down. Me and Gina was just living in the moment. Say hi Gina. Hey, Doesn't hey. she look beautiful? Thank you. She came so prepared with the New Orleans colors and I just threw some stuff together. But anyway, I'm making it work too. And yeah, we just on our way to go get beignets. We're gonna walk there. We had the luxury of driving, which is nice. Gina has driven us everywhere because I can't drive. <laughs> Thanks, Tina. But, um, yeah, so now we're off to go get beignets. And last night, we just, like, walked around. We, like, ate. Also, I don't know if I told y'all this, but Gina and I have not drank any alcohol on this trip, bro. Honestly, I came here prepared to get fucked up. <laughs> and then... I sat down with Gina, she picked me up from the airport and we got food and she was just telling me how she's been on this journey of not drinking and it's been two months since she's had alcohol. And I'm like, that's beautiful, that is amazing. And I honestly, you know, envision myself being that way too in about, you know, soon. I don't know when, but soon I wanna to commit to that lifestyle as well. So I put myself up to the challenge to not drinking as well. So I also haven't had alcohol <laughs> on this trip. So I've been, how many days over? Uh, since Friday, right? Yeah, so like three days sober. Look at me. Um, but yeah, not saying I'm going to cut it off completely because I feel like, I don't know. Although I'm not an al alky. Mm -hmm. I feel like I smoke I green better. more than anything. Oh, that was rhyming. But yeah, we're walking and then we're going to go get food. Oh, and then this is what we're wearing. Actually, Gina, let me get you and you get me. Uh, so, Gina, let's get an outfit breakdown. Oh, and it's perfect because you're standing in front of a blue 
wall. You look so nice and glowy. Also, get into Gina's skin. She already has beautiful skin, but we just put a little glow on her. I did it with my finger, mm -hmm. and I did her inner eye. And what else do you have on, Gina? Uh, this shirt. Oh, I was talking about face first. Oh, um, as far as skin, because your skin on, is beautiful. Uh, some Laura Mercier like setting powder. I don't have on any actual anything else uh, other than mascara. Um, I use. Some Fenty for the lip. Yes. That's it. Some little edge control. <laughs> um, as it's far so as the cute. outfit, uh, these are a Target special again. Oh my God, Jada with the Target special. I, I don't know. I just went in there and I found everything. This shirt, it was like two years old, maybe. It's the first time I'm wearing this from Discovery. Love it. You look so good. Thank you. Love the colors. Even her like nail color too just compliments the color she's been wearing so well. Thank you guys. Yeah! <laughs> Let's get and into it. this is my outfit of the day today, you guys. I feel like, you know, you guys have seen all these pieces, but whatever, you guys know I like to shop my closet. Gina was telling me how she chose to shop her closet too before going out to buy, buy, buy. Cause I feel like, especially when you're going on vacation, you just feel like you gotta buy new stuff. But I'm like, you know what, I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna chill out. And um, yeah. So I went through Connor's closet and I seen he had this little linen, little shirt, little button up situation. So I brought this because I'm like, I could probably, you know, pull it with, you know, a pair of trousers, which is what I'm doing today. And then uh, for trousers, let me zip up my fly. I'm just wearing these Office St. General trousers. They're 100% linen. And when I first got these trousers, I didn't like them because they were so wide leg, but I've come to really like them. I feel like they're such a little vibe, just, you know, flowy, flowy, flowy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we're off. I'm hungry. Wow. So you seen y'all seen me and Jenna do our little outfit of the day. We look real cute. We was ready to go for the day. And we was walking and we both was wearing pants as y'all saw. And we both, she said at first, she's like, I'm hot. I'm like, girl, I'm hot too in these damn pants, y'all. It is muggy out here in New Orleans. It's like 80 degrees, but it's like hot. It's humid. Okay, that's why. So yeah, I just put my little Jay-Z shirt back on, but I'm wearing it as a dress. <laughs> and Gina got her little cute little baby doll, black dress on, looking cute. And yeah, this whole time I've been um, Gina's man. <laughs> Gina taught me the trick yesterday is to shake it up. Oh shit. Oh no. It's got a wheel in it. Uh oh. Yeah, but to shake it up good like that. So then. Look at that. Look at that. It's like chicken. <laughs> He's so wrong with <laughs> Alright Jenny, you try now. <laughs> okay. Come on. I'm gonna try. Wow. <laughs> let's see, let's see. He said put it in here. Wait, like this. Wait. Girl, you got me out here looking like Oh, that sounded good. It did. Shake, shake, uh, uh, shake, uh, shake. Ah, uh, okay. Shouty. He is cute. But I just don't want it to fall off. I'm just gonna put it on. These are sick. I love these. We are new sunglass girls. Oh, oh we have I didn't put Oh. I got my on. I couldn't wait. I love the green accent. Can't see me. Oh I don't think I've ever seen anything like this chair. This is so sick, guys. Legs in the front and in the back. I bet you could turn it into like a table. Probably not, actually. 
This is how hot it is down here. You put your pot in there. Pool time. Whoa. Y'all, look what I can do. Hold on, wait. I want to see I can see. Wait. It's the keys to relax. Okay, wait. Now I can't do it. So I love this hotel, y'all. I don't know if I told y'all, but the jacuzzi is not hot. That's the only damn part about this hotel, I feel like. We're staying at the Frenchman, but otherwise, uh, that, otherwise, that. Otherwise, I would say this hotel is definitely worth checking out. Maybe you guys check it out in the future. Their jacuzzi will then be warm, but <laughs> right now, it's like not that warm. But I do love it. And then the pool, baby. Oh, the pool ain't that bad. I'm so dramatic, y'all. It's really not that bad, actually. Yeah. It's the last day here, so we're trying to take advantage of the pool while it's hot and not raining. It's been raining, like, all day. <laughs> in here and yeah look at my ankle y'all it's so cute i feel like a baddie and plus biddy small said that the um she said that the back shots hit different <laughs> when you have an ankle um but yeah tomorrow i'm going to get a pedicure y'all this is so embarrassing like my nails i'm like so ocd about my nails like this is the worst that they've ever looked very long time so yeah i'm probably gonna get a pedicure not probably. I am going to get a pedicure and I'm going to get my nails done tomorrow. So my flight isn't until 5 or 4, so I'm going to get up early and do that. Gina's flight leaves at 7, so she's going to be out early. B, I got a little time to so chill out a little bit. Hi, sir. I don't know if you turned it on. The bubbles aren't going. Yeah, the bubbles aren't bubbling. Turn it off. I don't think so. It's back right now. Oh, okay. Is it on now? It should be. And can we turn it up to like the 90? Yeah. Thank you so much, sir. Is it on? Let me see. Yep, it's on. Okay. Thank you. Ass fat. Yeah, no. <laughs> I want to be moving so bad. And if I'm honest, like. My body is just not where I want it to be. Like, I want it to have a little bit more booty. I want it to have a little bit just more jiggle. And it's not giving that on this trip. So, you know, the good thing about going on vacation is like, it puts you in the mindset of wanting to like do better when you get back home. So, okay, I've had my vacation. <laughs> you know, when I get home, I'm gonna be on my shit. So that's what I'm on right now. I'm like, when I get home, I'm gonna, Ready to eat a little bit more healthier and work out every day because I kind of fell off hard with working out. So yeah, this is basically what I thought I was gonna be giving, but y'all, I fell off with eating. So Gina is giving Barty Yardy for the trip. <laughs> Gina, do the body, do the booty thing. I don't know. It go like this. Yeah. <laughs> Look at my ankle wigs. so good, Gina. You're like a boss. <laughs> Find my dog. Yeah. You want to sit here, Gina? Huh? Is it? Is this finishing? No, this is next door. Oh, what is this? Marley's. Oh, is it Italian? Yeah. Uh, thank you. <laughs> now that's going to the home. This is where we're supposed to be going. Gina, I showed up, was like, what this white man doing greeting us at an African restaurant? <laughs> so this is where we're eating, guys. Like, I've never seen a bench like seating set up like this. So comfortable, actually. Thank you. So y'all, we just got through eating at this African restaurant called Benahan's. It was so, so good. 
Gina was more familiar with this type of food than I am. So she ordered, well, no, no, no. I, I had picked out my little stuff, but Gina had ordered our little appetizers and stuff, y'all. I'm gonna po post up a picture of what our meal looked like because I forgot to post pictures because it was so damn good. But yeah, I would definitely recommend that little African restaurant if y'all are ever in New Orleans. Shout out to my little friend that told me about it. So yeah. Now we're off to the Bywater. I've been wanting to go to the Bywater. The Bywater. The Bywater. Whenever I find out somebody from New Orleans or they got a little place in New Orleans, I'm always like, where you go? Where you be at? Yeah. And so I heard Bywater is where it's at, so. Quick little wardrobe change. Just wearing this little slip dress that I got from Urban Outfitters at their lingerie or at their sleep section, y'all. Like five years ago, and I have yet to part ways with it. But yeah, I don't know if y'all can really see her. The back is low, which is all what I love about it. I don't know if y'all can see that back. Just got up and supposed to be meeting these twins to do yoga right now but they're running late but it's all right I run late for everything else except for yoga so I get it but yeah I'm just like on the balcony which I showed you guys I don't know I'm doing it Good. yeah but yeah I'm up here on the roof of the hotel and we're gonna do yoga up here and I'm thinking it's gonna be amazing but right now, yeah, I'm just enjoying this stillness and this mugginess and this heat. I just love it so much. And um, yeah, this is a moment that I'm gonna like remember and look back on to calm me. The clouds are even beautiful. What do you, what do you guys see? What um, shapes? I feel like I see a heart. No, I see lips. You, got, you guys see the lips? It's like big juicy lips. Oh, what else? Yeah, it's just clouds actually. <laughs> so just got done going on a run with Craig. It was amazing. We, we didn't have time to do yoga because him and his brother are like in this house down here and they have to be there, I think by like 10. And um, so yeah, we just went on a run to this health food market, y'all. I thought I was gonna die. I, we got to the health food market, I'm like dripping sweat. But it was just such a lovely experience because um, Craig is really big on like, well, I'm talking about really big on breathing, but we all should be really big on breathing. And anyway, he's just really good with um, like his breathing techniques. So it was just so good to have him there. Like we were running, he's like, make a beat with your breath. Like, oh, like, <laughs> like, okay, cool, this is like, you know, not making it seem so bad. And um, it was just such a lovely experience. Like, I'm just so happy that I got to experience that. Like, I told him, like, this was the icing on the cake when it comes to this trip. And so yeah, I am leaving New Orleans just feeling so rejuvenated, just so alive and just so open to, yeah, like just my, I don't know. I feel like I, every time I leave New Orleans, like, I feel like it's just so, just shifting for me like I just go back with like a more open mindset and more of a mindset of like all right I need to get to it so I can get back here you know but yeah I'm so happy that Gina was just so open to just be on camera and just like live in the moment with me and yeah this was just such an amazing trip y'all I would highly recommend if you haven't been to all this come you know just experience the culture here a little just for a couple days even um 
and it's crazy because I told y'all me and Gina did not drink we I had one drink yesterday it was like just a little slurpee that I didn't even finish but yeah we got here you know I flew in Friday today is Monday and I've had one drink since I've been in freaking New Orleans which is crazy like you know New Orleans is a drinking town especially in the water which is where we're staying but it was just so liberating and just so stimulating to just talk um just soberly you know like I, I don't think I've done that in some time especially on vacation um I've, I've had sober conversations but I've yet haven't had so many on vacation that's what I really meant to say so so I bought these Rick Owen flip-flops like two years ago and my friend Kat chewed them up and I did like a wrong little turn and finally they're out of there y'all like I got through all of last summer with them looking like this but now they're they're just garbage now and it's so just sad like oh I mean I guess I could try to glue it but that's doing too much it's just gonna let these puppies go <sighs> so this is how I travel you guys I roll my stuff up like this and I just put it in my backpack this is the backpack that I always carry it's this chrome backpack and yeah I feel like if it can't fit in here then I really don't need to bring it so yeah so that's what I'm doing right now. It's like rolling all this stuff up. I was like going through and the reason why I'm recording right now is because I remembered that I didn't show you guys what I got from the thrift store. I also got this Nautica little button up here in addition to like the Jay-Z shirt. I got this little Nautica button up. And then I know this is crazy. I know some of you guys are like, why the heck do she buy white t-shirts at the thrift store? Because this type of cotton is like so hard to find. Like this very like soft cotton. It's a Hanes. It's like a um it's cotton polyester blend anyways i just like the way the the hanes t-shirts look and um yeah i feel like this is like white white so you can get some wears out of it and yeah i'm just rolling this up and putting it in the backpack Cooling gel. Cooling gel. Nice. My feet feel so soft. I just had to show y'all this like I'm like where's the restroom he's like right to the back y'all I come outside like what the hell is this a courtyard but I guess the restroom is right here wow look at this <sighs> well <laughs> that is the end of it all you guys my New Orleans trip is coming to an end I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog so smash the like button i think i didn't want to end the vlog earlier subconsciously when i was in the hotel because that would mean that my trip has come to an end but yeah i've got my nails done i love my nails so much and that crepe place oh my god y'all i would oh that was the best crepe i've ever had in my life like i don't think that's the only crepe i've ever had in my life actually now that i think about it but um yeah actually i think i have had one probably at ihop <laughs> but yeah much better than ihop that's for sure the crepe was like fluffy it wasn't too thin oh my god i had the apple cinnamon it was so good y'all love the atmosphere the owner he told me he's been working there by himself for the past two years and i'm like damn so like on a saturday he's like yeah saturdays it's a bit of a wait so it's a one-man band type of a thing but he might hire other people in the future he said but um yeah i'm about to get in my uber and go to the airport which my flight is freaking delayed possibly they said so who knows <sighs> but thank you guys so much for watching.